Good morning guys and welcome to vlog simber day 31 before I get started talking one I know I'm really dark I have my lights turned off and I have um, my blinds closed and two I know I have these two mountains on my forehead and this mountain on my cheek and that they're really red because I was just popping them so let's go ahead and look at them and laugh at them and say yay starting out the new year with big zits on my face because they decided to pop up yesterday they weren't there yesterday morning but now they're there so I partially blame the fever I had two days ago and then just some other things as well so we're just gonna address that so we can move on but it is the last day of 2015 15. I am feeling much better um, yesterday. Um, I didn't even run a fever until last night and it was a low 99 and I didn't even feel bad which I was so thankful for because um, day before yesterday I felt just so awful. I felt well enough to go to work yesterday. I mean I had no fever all day yesterday. I felt better than I did the day before when I didn't even know I was going to catch a fever till that night. Um, and I know I'm behind on all my uploads. I'm going to get caught up today, which I'll be caught up by the time you guys are watching this. But I filmed the 26th. I filmed the day I was sick. But I just haven't edited them and uploaded them due to not feeling well and just being busy. I should be, like, showering right now, but I wanted to go ahead and start the vlog, um, because I got up at, like, 8.15, and then my boss texted me that I could have the day off because we were going to close early anyway, and I was like, you know, normally I would rather be at work, but I was actually kind of excited to have the day off, so I have the day off today, and I was hoping I'd fall back asleep but I didn't which really sucks because I'm kind of tired but whatever um I just wanted to say that I hope you guys had an amazing year because 2015 for me was overall I mean some really great things happened don't get me wrong but overall I mean it was a really rough year like I know I've vlogged a lot this year and you guys just see um, the happy sides of things but a lot of things have happened like in my personal life that I don't show on YouTube that were just really bad on me and on my family and I mean there were some really bad deaths like in my family like really close relatives there were just a lot of bad things I mean I left like the only home I've ever known and moved here like which true my family had always wanted to live at the beach but like I moved and like left my friends and family which wasn't a bad thing it was a sad thing but good things came out of that um but it's just been a crazy crazy year and I'm so ready for a new year and a new start and I know you can start over like any day any week any month but it's something about a new year that's so refreshing and I'm so excited to count down tonight I wish I could be in Times Square I've always wanted to be in Times Square for New Year's Eve but I was thankful enough to have gone a couple of weekends ago and took a picture of the ball but overall that is just my preachy moment I'm just so excited for the new year it's gonna be kind of different this year just like Christmas and all the other holidays that we've had this year because I'm used to spending you know New Year's Eve in my house in my hometown with like all of my neighbors and Hannah comes over every New Year's Eve I was sitting this morning thinking like the last time I had like New Year's Eve without having Hannah over because she would come over every New Year's Eve and it was so fun. You guys know if you've seen the vlogs like all the crazy things we do and watching the countdown and eating our sausage dip. It's just going to be weird and different. Um, I'm excited but I wish Hannah could have been here for this New Year's Eve because it's kind of just a tradition that we've done for like years but this year is going to be different so I hope you guys have an amazing New Year. I'm going to be vlogging today throughout the day and of course tonight at midnight when it changes to 2016 which is so crazy but like I said I'm ready. So I also need to go take a shower but I'll vlog in a bit. This just made like my whole entire morning. Chine went out walking on the beach this morning with her friend and I um, asked her before she left if on the way back she'd bring me coffee from Duncan and she said she would so I texted her what I wanted. She just got home with my coffee. It's a medium iced caramel swirl coffee sweetened with cream. No sugar because the sugar grains are so gross. I just like the cream because it's really sweet without the sugar. Oh my goodness, it is so good. This just like made my morning. Eating a clementine orange because, duh. I'm just drinking. This is breakfast today. I might eat a banana because that's what I did yesterday. Hmm. Oh, that rain made it so humid out. So humid outside right now. It like rained for a little bit and now it's like so humid. Got my grape juice as per usual that I do every single New Year's Eve. Should I put this in the fridge? Yeah. Yes! Sparkling red grape. Excuse me, love. And false eyelashes. <laughs> so I just fixed me up a salad for lunch with this salad mix and some Thousand Island dressing. And then I also shredded up some pepperonis and put that on the top.
Alright, so I haven't vlogged in a, a long time, and it's kind of hard to even show you guys because it's like pitch dark outside, like what my makeup looks like. But we've just been getting ready because we're going to head out right before 6 to go down um, and eat with everybody, and then the party is going to be after that at the bar. And I'm really excited because I'm very hungry, and I'm so excited for the countdown that's tonight at 8, you know, in Times Square. One year I will go for New Year's Eve, but outfit-wise, I am wearing what I call my sickly outfit, which is what I wore like three days ago when my fever came on. It's just the cutout shirt from Aeropostale. Um, hide these straps. So it's my cutout shirt from Aeropostale. A cami, jeggings. I'm going to wear sandals, taking the same bag. And then I did my makeup, which took like forever because I'm wearing false lashes. And that makeup took me a long time. And I was telling like my family, I don't love it. But I like it. I just haven't mastered the technique of a black lid and a warm crease. So I like it. I just don't love it. I need to practice a bit. But I'm like sweating. It is so hot in here. Ooh, I'm dying. <laughs>
the I don't even know what it's called. It's like the like the countdown, or it's part of like the Rocky E. But it is in Hollywood, and it's actually Joe Jonas singing. I haven't seen him in a while. They had Nick sing twice, I believe, for the Times Square one. But it's actually Joe's the one. It's always Nick that you hear about. And then Mr. Cooper is so happy that we're home. He's just lounging with me here on the couch. And we're going to go to bed as soon as this goes off. I think it ends at 2.15. Like, I kind of wish it lasted till 3, but I think it ends in like 10 minutes. So, I think the last time I was up at 3 a.m. was probably on the way to and from New York City because I was up at like all sorts of crazy hours of the night, as you guys know. But I am about to head to bed. It is about 3 a.m. The rest of my family is asleep right now, so I'm trying to be quiet. Um, I just finished up getting ready for bed. We went ahead and, like, said goodnight and everything because they were all ready for bed and I wasn't. So, like, um, we said goodnight and they all went to sleep while I changed into my pajamas and washed off my makeup. And I um, uploaded my vlog from the 26th and 29th, which I edited, like, three times today. But it kept messing up and then it finally worked and then I forgot to upload it so I uploaded it really late tonight when I got home. Um, but that vlog is now up so they're all asleep and I'm still awake. I have a couple more things to do and then I'm going to head to bed. But like I said it's around 3am right now and I love you guys so much. I hope y'all had an amazing New Year's Eve. I, I love you guys so much. Thank you all so much for watching. Good night. Oh and happy January slash 2016. That's so weird. It literally says January. Holy cow.